Uh, everything seems right in your end, Kiwi, after that slight little decent error. Yeah, everything's fine. If, if things start getting a bit d***y, we'll, we'll, rest, we'll completely restart the, the game. We restart. Hang on, which is the, which is the, um... Which is the faction that have been scaring the crap out of you a little bit, Kiwi? Uh, the faction, they're not scaring the crap out of me, they're just keeping them happy, they want a lot of aggression. Construction complete. They they're the be... Strength Through Conquest Coalition. I need to change some of my demographics, no, not my demographics, my governmental situations for them. But we'll get to that in a minute. You have a, you get temples? I have a Archer, feeling I made a f all those alien races. Yeah, that's the whole idea, Declan. I think that, yeah, I think that's what your people do. Yeah, I'm kind of xenophobic. Yeah, that's what you do. Whoa, whoa, xenophobic. whoa, hang on, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do, are there, hang on. Is that a mod or is there actual, like, sort of voice dialogue in this? Through the, there, um... is voice There's vo there is voice dialogue in the vanilla races. They do grunt and make funny noises. Uh, okay. I don't yeah. know. What, I don't think mine actually make any noise. Ki Kiwis said something along the lines of Allahu Akbar to me. Good lord. Yeah, it's it's a jumble jumble mess of English, you know, letters and words. Now you're just... forgetting you chose the guy. Declans won't have the release because it's a it's a hundred percent modded in race. I don't even I, have movement. <laughs> no, mind you, they'll probably add that later on. Um, but I don't have I don't know if I have noise, but I use vanilla assets just repurposed. I do a little reading up on the mothball and they've changed it now. If say you have too many too many ships active at one time, System you can um, send a fleet to a space station with mothball on it, and they decommission them. But you can recommission them for a price. Have you bombarded their um, homeworld out of existence? Have you? Yep. <laughs> I was wondering why, because it's shifted. You plan? Do you plan to take any of their planets? I'm going to take one of them. I'm going to destroy two, then I'm going to offer for peace. Because I don't want them to stop existing, I need the rivalry from them to keep everyone happy. <laughs> You're pretty much just gonna kid- Wow, that did... I, I don't know what that Star Destroyer is doing, but <laughs> it just does not give a damn about the flight it's currently in. <laughs> wow, you are Wow, you've- Okay, I'm- I'm concerned. Because Kiwi actually has more powerful weapon systems than I do. He's a cheater, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> You're talking to a man who's running a ring world. I feel like we just need, need to insert, you know, Sergeant Dot Johnson's legendary speech there. <laughs> Be careful, there's a giant whole new world, God's own God. I can't, I can't remember it now. <laughs> so, the only reason to ever play Halo C on Legendary was for that speech. Yes. Um, shall we pick the pace up to fast, or keep it running normal? Anomaly found. Eh. Um, yeah, you can pick up if you want a little bit. You right, Liam? Yep. Right, as you know, just before we get a bit of a kerfuffle with some stuff popping up, I just wanted to make sure you know, we could get back into high gear before, you know, make sure everyone was ready for it. Oh, what's this? First contact with the Curator Sigma Enclave. Oh, they're, um... They're an enclave. They're, I, I, need, I need to actually talk... Wait, oh, where are they? Debris. I need to talk to these curators. Where the hell are they? Uh -oh. Here's the funny thing. I found this ring system. It's called Sanctuary. It's... I don't know whether it's half built or half destroyed, but it's, it's, it's not exactly in one piece. And there's a whole heap of automated defense fleets around. I'm wondering whether I should try and... Oh no. Oh no. Right. Am I still here? You're still here? Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh, don't tell me that you're about to. No, he's just completely lagged up. I'm gonna no. slow it down. Yeah, slow it down. And pause it until he catches up. Alright. And uh, oh, let that tick at that rate. Ships upgraded. 
Oh, what's happening? <laughs> I'm just messed. I was just, I accidentally knocked um, uh, the control sticks on my controller and I'm moving, I'm moving the camera around with the controller. <laughs> oh yeah, you can do that. That's actually pretty cool. <laughs> that would be awesome, sitting, you know, put this up on a big screen TV and just sit back and relax. You know, wireless keyboard and mouse and the controller. Oh, this is actually kind of like a, a pretty cool, like... If you did like some sort of cinematic kind of thing, that would actually you could actually do like an, a little cinematic sort of view. Yeah. With just moving the camera around with the controller, that's actually pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna see if that's I can communicate with these primitive alien species. It's a project I'm gonna do, so I gotta clear all enemy spacecraft out of sanctuary, and then find out what the go is with them. Nope, Kiwi just left. I'm saving it and pausing it and you see if we can get him oh, back. Oh, there we go. Now he timed out. See if we can get him back. It's a mission again! Alrighty, welcome back everybody. And boy, what a long intermission that was. <laughs> Just play the damn game. <laughs> <laughs> Probably should wipe out everything on that guy world, shouldn't I? Wait, is there a population on there, is there? Yeah. Oh, you found a pre... <laughs> Take it for yourself, you're that sort of empire. <laughs> yeah, but I can't. I've got too many planets as it is right now. I'll, I'll save it for later. Oh, well, a peace offer has been taken. Yep. Now let's see. What do these people on this planet like? Not me. It's like, we don't like you, but we like cheese. Alright, here... That's all you go. Oh. oh, it's not on my borders, but I found um, Steam Age Civilization. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What? Well, I decided to attack this the defense grid above this ring world to see if I can talk to these alien species on this planet. There's... But. I just my fleet is getting ripped apart. I did not expect such firepower to come out of these little stations. Dun, dun, dun. No worries, they're, they're fighting to the death. They fight to the death. Yeah. Oh, those guys are handling Research it. Research complete. All right, so I didn't need to System worry about fighting complete. those aliens then. Construction complete. Oh, goody, I can now, once I upgrade that station, I can now build strike cruisers. Okay, I'm calling a retreat there. My, <laughs> that, that, that fleet is just... Run away! Run away! Just do the Monty Python Holy Grail thing. Uh, my, my fleet that consisted of uh, 170 Research ships, only 100, you know, 70, uh, sorry, 7.7 thousand 7, firepower just got demolished. Dang. Yeah. I thought I'd better withdraw some ships in case an empire gets the bright idea to try and attack me. Well, hopefully this, uh, sink area you have, Kiwi, is not going to cause any issues. Shouldn't. I mean, the only problems I get when it comes to sync errors is that most of the stuff doesn't, like, doesn't fully register, like... It takes a few seconds for it to happen. Oh, it's not just that, like, if, say, for example, if I was trying to research something, only one thing won't research, as so it will not register at all. Wow, okay, that, that, that's concerning. But everyone's either equal or superior to me right now. System survey complete. I'm probably only equal. Liam's superior to me. Yeah. How do Holy I purge Yeah, your fleet plans. powers. Like, everything else is equal, but your fleet powers, like, interior. Uh, hey, feel me. How do I open up the purge? Uh, it depends. What do what you got? Like, is it a. Is it a, Do you control the planet? Yes. Okay, click on it, and you'll, and you'll see on the uh, population. When you click a population, yep. you'll have, you should have like a purge option. Resettle and set rights is all I've got. Alright then, set the rights, and then you want to set them to their purge type. To... Currently not being purged. Yeah, you want to set that to purge. I can't. Doesn't open. 
Is there another uh, way to move them off that planet? You can always um, force them to resettle to another planet. Move capital... Yeah, but I want to abandon this planet completely. You want to abandon a planet? Yes. It serves me no purpose. Um... Construction. Complete. Which planet is it? Uh, Corthan. Corthan? Corthan. I have no idea what... Where is it? It's the one I just took. Research complete. Uh, you can't. Okay. You can't do any purge types at all. Apparently not. Uh, check your policies then. Uh, policies and um, edicts. And then find out whether you can purge. Which should be under... I don't know. It'll be under there somewhere. Policies and edicts. Ah, purge. Displacement only. Can you switch that? I can switch it to prohibited. No, you don't. You don't want that prohibited. You want it. I know. I want as allowed. active as possible. I'm not xenophobic in any regard, and I'm not a hive mind, so I can't purge. Well, all you can do is population control them. Question is, would there be any good as a slave army? Not for my people. Slave army serves no purpose, and my people are basically Goku. What else are useful for? Oh, they're just basic slaves. Research complete. But for on their home planet, where they are mostly allow, I will mostly allow them to go unrestricted. And once you have the ability to colonize desert and maybe move some of your own population there to enforce laws against them. Oh, I can't. I really don't care. All of my armies are currently on that planet. There's nothing they can do. Oh, dude, you, you can take some of your armies off that planet. I've got no but reason to. You've got, you know... They, 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 they've got a plus 20, plus 21. You've got a minus 170 from your armies. Minus 170 what? Your armies are plus are doing a minus 170, plus you got the spiritual, which is a minus 10 on rest. So you, you only need, a, you know, a 17th of what you have there. Hmm. I'll move it if I have to. For now, there's no reason to. Mind you, you can have that happen to zero and they still won't rebel, because unrest is at zero. So, you know, Kiwi's now going full empire. <laughs> I don't think there was sheep in the Imperial Navy. System survey complete. If it, if it was doing sheep, I'd be saying beep, 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 beep. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, I wonder how many times we could possibly get away with all that. <laughs> Just bringing up that joke here and there. Too many. <laughs> All I can recommend is if you plan to do um, use the en enrichment programming on planets, use that planet as a test. Because nine out of ten times, if something goes horribly wrong, the planet blows up. Hang on a second. Oh. <laughs> that you creepy looking. Yeah, my non-aggression track with the, um, uh, I don't know how to pronounce it, but the Ongoy Alliance has been broken. That's how you pronounce them, Ongoy. Ongoy, okay. Pretty much, Lingus needs to sign a defensive pack with a few people and they won't touch him. Alliance Yeah, I can't, I can't even close borders of those because we're in the truce after the... Yeah, hang on, so I'm going to offer star charts to Liam then. Incoming transmission. Construction. Boys, completed. believe it or not, I'll hate me with whatever you want. I have found a third guy I will. God damn it. You count the one that I currently exist on, I found three. I found one. Wait, no, I think four. No. Oh, now I found you. <laughs> I've now found Declan. Whereabouts are you, Declan? Oh, you've colonized your first world, Declan. Yes. Oh, there he is. I hate to I went... world. Yes. 
Oh, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. I thought I already um encountered Declan. You did, but you probably haven't actually communicated with him. Oh. Research complete. Construction complete. But um, yeah, Liam, I'd recommend you sign some defensive packs with some people. All right. Hang on, wait a minute, hang on. Oh, the, okay, so I, so that is actually a completely different, um, empire, but it's using one of the modded, um, modded, um, race skins or whatever. Yeah, the young guy, yeah. Why is everyone declining all my offers? Probably people aren't I might, them. I might have missed yours, actually, so. Uh, Alright, I'll, I'll do it again. Yeah, try sending it again, because I was a little bit, uh, preoccupied. Because I need your star chest because I want to see who you're fighting. There we go. Well, I'm not fighting anyone at the moment. Who you will be fighting. <laughs> you will be fighting them. <laughs> you will start to fight them. Okay, apparently my modifier, one of my modifiers is salty. Uh, oh, so I used to have that one. <laughs> one of your planets has a, is rich in a certain salt mineral which people like. <laughs> well, it's a good thing though, because that's given me a uh, five percent ha uh, hap uh, five percent happiness. Was it a surprise? Hey, some of this stuff is still new to me. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I know that I have played a fair bit of this, but I'm still relatively new to certain bits and pieces. Some unlucky Has anyone just tried to attack me. Has anyone enter encountered the the Sigma on Encl Enclave? Yeah. Is that a fallen empire? It's, no, no, it's an enclave. Oh, okay. It's, um... Sigma think, enclave. Think about that for a second, Declan. Completed. That's Liam. I'm telling you, that's a Declan, though. You should join the Sigma enclave. Or the lady. Become one of us. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Never. Go through, uh, go through this with me again for a minute. Uh, there's a Warhammer game called Age of Sigma. Um... And I just got into it. Oh, f someone wanted. There we go. And you declined so... my offer again, Liam. No, I accepted it. That's weird. Oh, it could possibly be. Um, that's another thing uh, that happens to me that's when I am out of sync. Sometimes I can't accept um so offers oh, because it just because I don't know why. Yeah. But it just does that. I've accepted both that have come in. Wait, I only sent one. <laughs> I know, you only sent another one as well. Oh, okay. And it is not... It's not working. Yeah, that's that's because of the desync. That's uh, what desync. the done. Yeah. Do I quit and rejoin? Uh, yeah, I've got no issues Research if you want to rejoin. Oh, okay, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright. Found my fourth guy world, and it's right next to the other guy world that I just found. Which means you're probably approaching on a uh, fallen civilization. I'd be careful. <laughs> yep. There's like one more area that I have not surveyed yet, which I'm going to survey now. <coughs> but in the meantime, I'm actually going to wrap up uh, this uh, recording session. So like the last session, I'm going to put this into parters because why the hell not? But thank you very much guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then click the like button. Click the subscribe button for more videos heading away. Until then, this is Let's Play Stellaris. Again, all of the mods that we have used for this particular game session will be in the link, will be in the, link in, the, in the description as always. I can't talk right now. But thank you very much, uh, Kiwi, uh, Declan, and Fieldy for joining me today. Not tonight. Bye-bye. Until next time, I hope you guys enjoy. Have a good day. This is Liam from Lisa Australia.